morning guys happy tuesday it's like 5 15 a.m and i am starting my morning off as usual with a cup of iced water with lemon and my teeny profit tea and my calcium supplements so this is how i start my morning good morning guys here is breakfast so i am still finishing up my water I have a, my first cup of coffee. This is coffee with um, three tablespoons of sugar-free vanilla for one point. I have 227 grams of plain non-fat Greek yogurt, which is three smart points. And then I put in a dash of cinnamon in there and I put a dash of vanilla extract, mix it up. And then on top of that, I have added some, I've added three sliced strawberries, some raspberries. I did a teaspoon of unsweetened coconut for zero points. I did a half a teaspoon of chia seeds for zero points. And then I did a eighth of a cup of granola for one, for two points. Let me show you the granola I used. Okay. So this is the granola I used. This is the bare naked vanilla almond fit granola. So for an eighth of a cup, it is two points for a quarter cup is four points. I if once I use this up, I am going to make my own granola. I'm gonna see what I can find for low point granola. So I'll be, I just wanna use this up first. And once it's up, I am going to make my own. So maybe this weekend I will do that in meal prep. I don't know, we'll see what I can find. And then I have one of these sourdough English muffins from Franz. These are three points, which is the same amount of points as the light ones and the Thomas ones, and these are so good. So if you like sourdough, see if you can find a three-point sourdough English muffin because they are good. And it has spray butter on there and then one tablespoon of sugar-free red raspberry preserves for zero. So this is my breakfast. So we have three, four, five, five points for the yogurt and the granola, and then one point for the coffee and three points for this. So that's five, eight, nine, nine-point breakfast this morning. Okay, so as you can tell from the darkness, I still don't have that light fixed. I thought I had a light bulb, but it was a heat lamp one, so don't wait till this weekend to get my light fixed. So meanwhile, we're going to have lots of shadows in the mornings until that's fixed. Um, I have a big salad here. Um, there is spinach and super greens on the bottom here. I have a half a cup of quinoa for two points. I have some grapes for zero, cabbage for zero. I have two tablespoons of reduced sugar dried cranberries for two. I have one ounce of fat-free feta for one. I have an eighth of a cup of sliced almonds for two. And that is it, right? I was gonna add some apple, but I think I'm just gonna bring my apple to snack on. I was gonna cut it up, but I decided not to because I have the grapes in there and the cranberries. And then I'm gonna top that off with some of the Bold House Balsamic Vinaigrette for two points. So the salad is seven, eight, nine for that. Then snacks today, I have a mini Baby Bell light cheese for one, an apple for zero, muscle milk for one point, this um, coconut colada drink for zero, and then some vegetables for zero. So this is my lunch and my snack today. Hi everyone, so I am almost to work. Traffic was crazy today, so I couldn't jump on here until just now. Um, I am gonna be late because I had to stop. I had to go back in the house and grab my sweater. It is so cold out here this morning. It's supposed to be 90 something today, but it's only 50 degrees right now. It's also extremely smoky. Um, we have like 75 active fires around us right now. Um, I run the in the national forest right around us, and it has just caused nothing but haze and smoke. And I'm wondering if that's been contributing to my throat and coughing issue, or if I really am sick. I don't know. I'm feeling better today. Energy wise, I'm feeling a lot better, but I still have a little tickle in my throat, still a little bit of a cough. So we'll see how that goes. I um, have a really super busy day today. I literally have meetings starting at eight o'clock this morning. And I think the last one is at two 30 and I do have lunch in between there and the meetings, I have like four meetings. So they're just kind of back to back. And it's all because of our in-services we're doing at the school districts over the next couple weeks, which is going to put me in the car a lot, which I am really kind of stressing about as far as food-wise. So I'm going to be, t you know, asking you guys for some advice on how to handle all that. Tomorrow is the first one. Um, we will be down in the, our other um, work site, which is about an hour and a half away from us. 
So we'll be down there tomorrow and I didn't plan on having lunch down there, but I found out we may be having lunch down there, but I'm still thinking about taking my lunch with me and um, just eating in the car and not eating anything when we go to lunch. Maybe just having like a diet soda or, um, you know, iced tea, something like that. Just something that's, um, you know, and just saying, I'm just not going to, I'm just not hungry. My rest of my coworkers know that, you know, I, I want to eat healthy. So I don't know. We'll see where we go. It's a town I don't know anything about. So I don't know what restaurants are there or anything. So that's kind of a bummer. I'm late to work, but I'm going to call my husband real quick. Um, let's see. Dinner tonight is going to be the crock pot skinny taste, um, Santa Fe chicken. So I'm going to have that on tostadas and I did show you that and it will be part of my dinner ideas video, which I'm going to try to get up on no later than Saturday. I'm going to do some voiceovers on that so I can kind of tell you about the recipes and the, and what I did with each of the meals. So those I'll have to watch them and then make, take my notes and then do, I just like actually found the voice recorder on my phone. So, um, I, and I tried that last night as you guys probably saw in the video and yesterday's video. I did I tried it out and it seems to work really well so I'm gonna do that with those dinner idea videos since when I make dinner you know the house is kind of chaotic and TV or computer on and you know all that stuff you know going on so anyway I'm gonna get into work if I have anything to share with you after work I will jump on here and let you know I am I seem to be feeling a little bit better today so I hope I am goodness it was terrible and I didn't have to be in meetings all day today traveling tomorrow for work and then next week we have two in services to travel back and forth to and then the week after that we have like six of them in one week so I probably won't be working Friday before Labor Day which will be nice only because I have so many hours for the week so I think I'm gonna probably take that whole day off and just whatever hours I do have, I'll just use personal hours for those so I don't have to come into work for an hour or two because that just seems like a waste. So we'll see how it goes. So I'm gonna jump in there. I hope you guys are all having a fantastic week and let me know what you are having for dinner tonight. I need some ideas on making my meal plans. So let me know what you guys are doing for dinner tonight and I will talk to you guys all later. So for dinner tonight, I'm having the Skinny Taste Crock-Pot Santa Fe Chicken on two tostada shells with a quarter cup of fat-free refried beans. I'm also having a little side salad as well as some ice water with lemon. And that will do it for me for today on another What I Ate on 30 Smart Points on Weight Watchers. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye guys.